What's going on everybody? Welcome back to Let's Play Final Fantasy X. This is probably going to be the last episode I record for today just because this is a, another episode with a lot of cutscenes and uh, I need to go ahead and start getting edited or uh, getting all these things edited together so I can actually upload them. So uh, let's just get into it. You said... You play Blitzball? Uh-huh. You know... You should go to Luca. Someone might know who you are, or you might find someone you recognize. Luca? Ah. Uh. Huh. Okay, leave it to me. I'll get you to Luca. Promise. You'd rather stay here? Uh-uh. Okay, I'll go tell the others. Wait here. Oh. And one thing. Don't tell anyone you're from Xanarkand, okay? Yevon says it's a holy place. You might upset someone. Hmm. Oh, uh-huh. <laughs> of course, he's gonna have that debate about Xanarkand being holy, isn't he? My Xanarkin? Or we're just gonna... Oh, well, hey, kind of <laughs> there we go. holy place? Yeah, right, I thought. Since when? Yevon? Sin? Luca? I thought Sin just took me to a faraway place. That I could go back in a day or two. But a thousand years into the future? No way! Well, that's not good. <laughs> Look at him roll. Look at that guy roll. <laughs> I still have no idea what they're saying there. Oh no, and there he goes. Not necessarily to never see Riku again, but not for a long time we won't see her. Gosh, we won't see her for, for a really long time, actually. Yes, yeah, so let's go ahead and save the current game. and we'll, uh, we'll be moving on to the next major area. There's quite a few things that we're going to do when we get here. This is uh, where the game starts to really pick up a little bit, thankfully. Riku! Ball. Hey, you okay? Hey! <laughs> oh, immediately into CGI. <laughs> His hair. It's crazy. Alright, so there's a couple things that we need to do. Uh, first off, when we go this way, we'll be picking up a, a secret treasure. Or as uh, Nino Capri Sun would call it, a secret treasure! And uh, this right here is the Moon Crest, which is used. Oh, voice crack. <laughs> Which is used uh, a lot later on in the game. We're we're not going to actually be using this item until significantly later. And if we go on the west side, well, well after we get away from these guys, that is. Yo, hiya. Uh, you 
wanna try that move one more time? Finally, things were starting to look up. Zanarkin Abes. What team you say again? Uh, I meant... forget that. Uh, I got too, uh, close to sin, and my head's all foggy-like. So, uh, I don't know where this <laughs> place is. Well, you have excuses. Sin's toxin got to you, but you're still alive. Praise be to Yevon. All right, back to practice. I'm Waka, coach and captain of the Besaid Oryx, brother. <laughs> what? You hungry? Okay, back to the village. I'll get you something. Before we do that, though, uh, as I was saying, if we go over here to the west side of the beach, there should be another treasure chest. Uh, question is where? There it is. And this should have two antidotes in it. It sure does. And now, if we talk to all of the uh, Aurochs here, we'll be able to get a few other items, which are relatively useful. That shot was spectacular, brother. I wish I could shoot like that. Oh, well, I guess he gives me nothing. Hey, I'll admit it, we're not the best blitzers in Spira. Wow, nothing either? I really want to make Cap and Waka proud at this year's tournament. Nothing from him either, okay. I can head the ball pretty good. Today is just a bad day, y'all. Yeah. I gotta stop closing my eyes when the ball comes down. <laughs> well, I guess, uh, I guess you don't get anything. Huh. All right. I felt like I could trust this Waka, so I just had to ask. Um, it's true Xanarkin was destroyed, right? A thousand years ago? So it's just a big pile of rubble now, isn't it? Long time ago, there were a whole lot of cities in Spira. Big cities with machina, machines to run them. People played all day and let the machina do the work. And then, well, take a look. Sin came and destroyed the machina cities. And Xanarkand along with him. Yeah, that was about a thousand years ago. Just like you said. If you ask me, sin's our punishment for letting things get out of hand. What gets me, though, is we gotta suffer because of what some goofballs did way back when. Of course, we must always repent for our sins. That's important. It's just that it's hard to keep at it sometimes, you know? It was just as Riku said. Waka and Riku couldn't both be lying. Why would they? <laughs> oh man, that's kind of creepy looking. <laughs> but you from the Xanarkand Daves, that was a good one, huh? Hey, I'm not saying that team never existed, yeah? <laughs> but you gotta figure, a team living in luxury like that be pretty soft, eh? I appreciated the fact that Waka was trying to cheer me up. But at that time, all I could think about was... Everything that happened to me, all this, started with sin. Maybe if I could find Sin one more time, I could go home. For now, I'd just live life until that time came. No more worrying about where or when I was. Sure, it was hard not to think of home, but I started to feel better already. A little better. Maybe. <laughs> Maybe. Uh, well, I mean, when you've been riding on the back of Sin for as long as you have, you know? I bet, uh... Oh, here we go. Now I can start picking up the stuff. You know, I, I bet that probably does, you know, make you pretty tired. Oh, you just got hit in the head. There's our potion. And we should get something else. Oh, not from here.
Oh, well, I guess that's it. That's okay. We'll just, uh, I guess we'll just go ahead and move on then. Uh, I guess we'll save first. And I've still got, uh, like another five minutes. I can probably make it to, like, the next save point, so... That'll be fine with me. If I need to, uh, I'll record a slightly longer episode. Alright, let's keep on going. Hey, this way. All right, well, I guess we'll go this way. It's interesting, this is an area that you'll never return to later on in the game. <laughs> What's the big idea? All right, so there are there is some random combat that we'll run into here, and uh, there are a few more chests that we can find yet again underneath the water here. Now I'm not 100% sure where they are, so I may have already missed one. Uh, well, here's one of our combats. Uh, why do you attack him? Because I don't know how strong Waka is right off the bat. Yeah, it probably doesn't actually matter who attacks who at this point. And at this point, the, the AP levels that you're going to be getting are also pretty inconsequential. It You don't really even have to start grinding until you get to... Uh, not for a long time, actually. You don't really need to start worrying about getting all the sphere levels. Maybe until you get to... After Luka, honestly. Like... Like... Up until then, the game is pretty straightforward. It's a whole lot of just pressing the X button a bunch of times. Uh, actually, whenever you get your full party, which will happen by the time we get to the end of this island, um, it becomes pretty clear that th this battle system is actually pretty complicated, and there is quite a lot that you can do. Um, well, there's the anecdote. And I believe that was actually the last chest, so I think I missed the other two. There was uh, two more chests, one with a Phoenix down and one with a High Potion. In the end, those really just don't matter. I just figured I would try to pick them up just so I could show them since I never have. But since I didn't find them, yeah, it's not that big of a deal. Like I said, I ordered a, a different mic stand, and that should be coming in. Uh, pretty soon, that should be coming in sometime like mid next week, and I should be uh, start recording um, with the microphone a smidge closer to my face, which should make a, a big difference. Also, this water graphics give me a huge headache. Oh my gosh! Oh no, we got ambushed. Ow! So let's see. These guys are piranhas, which are. Still the same. And we have one group of three. Which... You should be died now. You should be died? <laughs> you should be dead now. And indeed you are. Man, didn't get a single level out of that. That's okay. Like I said, at this point, you're just not gonna really be earning XP quick enough to really do anything. Ah! Uh. Let me go! Got a favor to ask you. You want me on your team, right? Hmm? A major Blitz tournament coming up. All the teams in Spira will be there. It's so huge, I'm sure someone there will recognize you. Then, you can go back to your old team, right? It'll be fun. What do you say, huh? Come on, come on. Sure thing. You can tell he just seems depressed, rock, annoyed, eh? sad. He just doesn't seem all that interested, really. He he seems I then the very sin dislocated, the two Spira, that which Spira makes sense. Had in common. I wasn't too far off either. Yeah.
This is where I was born. I started Blitz when I was five. I joined the Aurochs at 13, 10 years ago. 10 years, and we never won a game. Well, after last year's tournament, I quit. Time seemed right. It's <laughs> about how I feel right now, too. I want to go make some ramen after this. So, after quitting, I got this new job, yeah? But every time my mind wandered, I thought about the game. Ten years without a single win will do that. Hmm. My first match last year was my big chance. But something else was on my mind. I couldn't focus. Nice excuse. Hey, hey! So, you want to win the next tournament? Go out with a bang. So, what's our goal? I don't care how we do. As long as we play our best. If we give it our all, I can walk away happy. Uh, no, 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 no. If I say, what's our goal? You say, victory! When you play in a Blitzball tournament, you play to win. Victory? You're serious? All right. And uh, let's see, I believe that if we get down here, we should be able to get to a save point and we should be able to stop. The one from the sea. But of course, another cutscene. Be on guard. This episode's gonna be a little bit longer. Sorry about that. After surviving your Actually, I don't know, maybe you'll enjoy the concept. If something happens now. Who are they? Luzu and Gata, Crusaders. Huh? A cruise of what? What? You forgot that too? Hey, sorry. Don't worry about it. I'll help you out. Cool. In return, come tournament time, I'll make sure we take the cup. Cool. About the Crusaders, you can ask them yourself. They got a lodge in their village. Yeah, pretty much. It's it's pretty cut and dry from here. Just what we actually kind of get set a little bit loose here, which is kind of fun. He saved village. Ah, oh, another cutscene. Got any food there? We'll get you something over there later. Take a look around first. Let's see. The Crusaders' lodge is over yonder. Luzu and Gata are usually there. Hmm. All right. Over here. Huh? What's up? You do remember the prayer, right? Uh, I didn't know it in the first place, to tell the truth. I guess we'll just go with that. That's like the basics of the basics. All right, I'll show you. say Waka does look a little bit less um I don't even know how to describe it he just doesn't look nearly as uh, good as he did in the PS2 version in a way his face just okay, seems now a little bit too present yourself to the temple summoner perfect any maybe. blitzball player would know that prayer it was the blitzball sign for victory This episode is a little bit overdue. Uh, oh, well, where is a safe point then? <laughs> uh, let's see. We are pretty much here to dilly dally and do whatever. Uh, I believe there's one in here. I don't think I have to talk to them right away either. I don't. Okay, good. That's actually very good. That gives me the opportunity to stop for now. <laughs> All right, well, I hope you guys have enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Final Fantasy X. Hope you guys are looking forward to the next episode. If you guys enjoy the content, make sure you guys leave a like, comment, and subscribe, and I'll catch you guys on the next episode. Hope you guys have a wonderful day, and see you.